Yahushua is the Messiah. Ezekiel 34, verse 11 to 31 For thus saith the Sovereign Yahweh. Behold, I, even I, will both search my sheep, and seek them out. As a shepherd seeketh out his flock in the day that he is among his sheep that are scattered. So will I seek out my sheep, and will deliver them out of all places where they have been scattered in the cloudy and dark day. And I will bring them out from the people, and gather them from the countries, and will bring them to their own land, and feed them upon the mountains of Israel by the rivers, and in all the inhabited places of the country. John 15, verse 13 Greater love hath no man than this, that a man lay down his life for his friends. John 10, verse 11 to 18 I am the good shepherd, the good shepherd giveth his life for the sheep. But he that is an hireling, and not the shepherd, whose own the sheep are not, seeth the wolf coming, and leaveth the sheep, and fleeth, and the wolf catcheth them, and scattereth the sheep. The hireling fleeth, because he is an hireling, and careth not for the sheep. I am the good shepherd, and know my sheep, and am known of mine. As the Father knoweth me, even so know I the Father, and I lay down my life for the sheep. And other sheep I have, which are not of this fold, them also I must bring, and they shall hear my voice. And there shall be one fold, and one shepherd. Therefore doth my Father love me, because I lay down my life, that I might take it again. No man taketh it from me, but I lay it down of myself. I have power to lay it down, and I have power to take it again. This commandment have I received of my Father. Isaiah 50, verse 5 to 10 The Master Yahweh hath opened mine ear, and I was not rebellious, neither turned away back. I gave my back to the smiters, and my cheeks to them that plucked off the hair, I hid not my face from shame and spitting. For the Master Yahweh will help me. Therefore shall I not be confounded, therefore have I set my face like a flint, and I know that I shall not be ashamed. He is near that justify of me. Who will contend with me? Let us stand together, who is mine adversary. Let him come near to me. Behold, the Master Yahweh will help me. Who is he that shall condemn me? Lo, they all shall wax old as a garment. The moth shall eat them up. Who is among you that feareth Yahweh, that abideth the voice of his servant, that walketh in darkness, and hath no light? Let him trust in the name of Yahweh, and stay upon his Elohim. Zechariah 12, verse 10 And I will pour upon the house of David, and upon the inhabitants of Jerusalem, the spirit of grace and of supplications, and they shall look upon me whom they have pierced, and they shall mourn for him, as one mourneth for his only son, and shall be in bitterness for him, as one that is in bitterness for his firstborn. Isaiah 40, verse 2 to 5 Comfort ye, comfort ye my people, saith ye Elohim. Speak ye comfortably to Jerusalem, and cry unto her, that her warfare is accomplished, that her iniquity is pardoned, for she hath received of Yahweh hand double for all her sins. The voice of him that crieth in the wilderness, Prepare ye the way of Yahweh, make straight in the desert a highway for our Elohim. Every valley shall be exalted, and every mountain and hill shall be made low, and the crooked shall be made straight, and the rough places plain, and the glory of Yahweh shall be revealed, and all flesh shall see it together, for the mouth of Yahweh hath spoken it. John 1, verse 6 to 14 There was a man sent from Yahweh, whose name was John. The same came for a witness, to bear witness of the light, that all men through him might believe. He was not that light, but was sent to bear witness of that light. That was the true light, which lighteth every man that cometh into the world. He was in the world, and the world was made by him, and the world knew him not. He came unto his own, and his own received him not. But as many as received him, to them gave he power to become the sons of Yahweh, even to them that believe on his name, which were born, not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of man, but of Yahweh. And the word was made flesh, and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory, the glorious of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. John bare witness of him, and cried, saying, This was he of whom I spake, he that cometh after me is preferred before me, for he was before me. And of his fullness have all we received, and grace for grace. For the law was given by Moses, but grace and truth came by Yahushua the Messiah. No man hath seen the Father at any time. The only begotten Son, which was in the bosom of the Father, he hath declared him. 
And this is the record of John, when the Jews sent priests and Levites from Jerusalem to ask him, Who art thou? And he confessed, and denied not. But confessed, I am not the Messiah. And they asked him, What then? Art thou Eliah? And he saith, I am not. Art thou that prophet? And he answered, No. Then said they unto him, Who art thou? That we may give an answer to them that sent us. What sayest thou of thyself? He said, I am the voice of one crying in the wilderness, Make straight the way of Yahweh, as said the prophet Isaiah. MT 3, verse 16 And Yahushua when he was baptized, went up straightway out of the water, and, lo, the heavens were opened unto him, and he saw the spirit of Elohim descending like a dove, and lighting upon him, and lo a voice from heaven, saying, This is my beloved Son, in whom I am well pleased. John 8, 58-59 Yahushua said unto them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, Before Abraham was, I am Acts 13, 22-23 And when he had removed him, he raised up unto them David to be their king, to whom also he gave their testimony, and said, I have found David the son of Jesse, a man after mine own heart, but shall fulfill all my will. Of this man's seed hath God according to his promise raised unto Israel a Savior, Yahushua. John 3, verse 36 He that believeth on the Son hath everlasting life, and he that believeth not the Son shall not see life. But the wrath of Elohim abideth on him. Luke 7, verse 16 And there came a fear on all, and they glorified Yahweh, saying, That a great prophet is risen up among us, and that Elohim hath visited his people. John 11, verse 25 to 26, I am the resurrection, and the life, he that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live, and whosoever liveth and believeth in me shall never die. Believest thou this?